What's up everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Whistling Waters Outdoors. I am headed today, I am headed back to do the creek thing and uh, going to meet up a couple faces, a couple pretty familiar faces. First time me fishing with them but I, I have a feeling y'all have probably seen them before but uh, headed out with old Bama Beach Bum. You know he's a big big guy in this area, does a lot of beach fishing, just absolutely hammers the pompano and stuff from the surf. But we're getting out with him and then we got a special guest today the Whisper. Um, I'm sure y'all have seen him. He's huge on YouTube. Got about 220,000 subscribers. And he uh, he's the guy that hand feeds bass. The just monster bass right there and everything. So that'll be that'll be cool. I'm taking him out. Gonna put him on the creek experience today. Hopefully hopefully we can find us a few reds and a few trout. Um, weather's just perfect for it. You know, partly cloudy, uh, sunny skies besides that, light south wind. So it's just setting up to be a perfect morning. Well, almost perfect morning. Um, running, running about 45 minutes late. I got all the way down here into Gulf Shores and realized did not bring the keys to the trailer, so I was not able to get the kayak off of the trailer. So I had to had to make a U-turn and head all the way back to the house. But I got the keys now. I'm headed back down there. I ought to be there in just a few minutes. So y'all stick with us. Hopefully we can get on the fish pretty quick. It's a good start. Hopefully we can continue that, keep pushing up, we can get Matthew a fish pretty quick. Yeah, we're out here working the creeks. Like I said, we're doing the creek thing, throwing some top water for redfish, trying to pick up some trout. For, you know, it's a Thursday out here. We got a ton of people out here for a Thursday. Um, did not expect it to be this crowded, but like I've said in a few of my previous videos, it's summertime, it's the season, so. Just gotta keep keep pushing to them. Luckily, you know, a lot of these creeks hang out, or a lot of these boats hang out outside of the creek, so we can push up in and not have to worry about them. But we're out here, showed them the Whistling Waters experience. Hopefully we can get on a few more fish pretty quick, but y'all stick with us and we'll see what happens. Oh, we're doubled up. Heck yeah. Nice. <laughs> yeah, he's not bad. He's probably 18, 19. Oh, here we go. <laughs> On the board. There we go. GoPro, turn off. There we go. There we go. All right. <clears throat> Got my cameras ready. Got my baits ready. They're pushing down ahead of us. Hopefully they'll get on some redfish pretty quick. I'm gonna try to pick up a couple more trout real fast and move down there with them. Hopefully that'll be the theme for the morning. Hadn't had the best start, like I said. You know, I forgot my forgot the keys to the trailer lock back at the house, so I had to turn around, but. We're out here. I'm feeling the good vibes this morning. Just something telling me we're going to have a great day of fishing. Alright y'all, we got Kyle who's on a good one over here. He has been whispering him up on the top water this morning. I think this is about his fourth or fifth one. That's a good one. That is a heck yeah. <laughs> See if I can't pick one off on the old flex mullet real quick. Ah! Good night, look at that. What just happened? 
Like there, there he is. Golly. Skipping them in. Hey. My camera was off, but it was on. Oh, <laughs> barely hooked. Is it really? Dude, that is awesome. That is the first tag trout I've seen out here. That is too freaking cool. There we go, guys. Took me a while, but I got me another good trout. That's a bat one. I'm gonna let her go pretty quick and go over here. Kyle's got a tag trout. Something new they've kind of been doing here lately. Within the past year or two, and he got one. That's the first one I've seen this year. So that is, that is too freaking cool. I'm gonna go over there and check that out. Oh yeah, you got a reward for this one. Awesome. Let's see. Look at there. I'm gonna unhook it and uh, get that information off of it okay. for you. Are you not supposed to keep tag trout, or are you supposed to keep them? What um, it it's you know, it, you can keep them. You you can let them go. Um, it's kind of up to you. I like to let the tag fish go just so they can get more. You know, like we'll get the numbers off this one. Turn turn it in. Um, yeah, and then they'll get. Alright. Alright, let's see. Take it out. No, um, there's some numbers on it, but it's hard to read. Yeah. Alright. A let's see, do one of y'all have your phone? You can put some yeah. notes in. I, I'm recording. So Alright. AT two one two nine one zero. AT two nine one zero. Yeah. Right. I got it on. Right. Yeah, so they I don't, I don't know what South gives for them. Usually you can choose between a t-shirt, a hat, or a long sleeve shirt. Let's see, she is. Yeah, what do they need reported? Just length? Or? Yeah. So she's 17 and 3 quarters. Picture. Got it. There she goes. That is freaking That's awesome, cool, dude. Have you, have you ever seen a tag trout? That is the first tag trout I've ever seen in my life. That's so cool, man. They, yeah, they started... Of course, the fish whisperer is going to find it. You know, that he, is... If it's out here, he's going to find it. Right? <laughs> dude, that is freaking cool, man. First tagged fish I've ever seen out here. First tagged trout I've ever seen. I didn't know they really tagged trout. It's... They just started doing it um, the past few years. All right, y'all, that is going to do it for today. Um, you know, I got the intro a little late, so I didn't get uh, didn't get old Beach Bum or Fish Whisper in it. But, man, we absolutely tore into him today, especially Fish Whisper. He got, I mean, I lost track of how many reds he pulled up on top water, but he was just absolutely hammering him. Then he got that tag speckled trout. That is too freaking cool. First tag trout I have ever seen in my life. First tag fish I've ever seen come out of here. So I'm wondering, I'm wondering if it's old Patrick Garmison from Ugly Fishing that tagged that one. I've seen he's been tagging a lot of trout in this area lately. So be interested to see the results from that one. But talk about a great day. You know, Beach Bum, had, uh, first time, well, not first time, but first time really heavy fishing in the kayak, I believe is what he said. He's been in some before, but never really, you know, didn't ever really get after him too heavy, but you know, we did it today. Like I said, you know, got a bunch of trout. He ended up getting some trout. Um, 
couldn't get the redfish but it was still you know still had a great day uh, you know if y'all hadn't if y'all aren't following them already make sure you check them out i'll drop their uh, their channel link in the description below but fish whisper he's got some of the coolest slow-mo hand feeding bass eats i've ever seen in my life beach bum is just the absolute tank on the beach you know he crushes them off the beach so make sure you check out their channels they got a lot of great content a lot of a lot of good information to be picked up there but you know as always i really appreciate y'all watching today's video you know it was a wasn't as much fishing by me as I usually do, but we still had a great time. But, you know, it was just, just an awesome day. But if y'all like this little collab, you know, go ahead and um, shoot me a thumbs up. Drop me a comment below. Let me know you enjoyed it. Um, I'll make sure. I'll try to get some more of these done. I know me and Beach Bomb are definitely planning on getting out again. I think Fish Whisperer said he's going to come back in the fall with his slow-mo camera and get some of those eats. So it's just going to be, it's going to be awesome. Um, but yeah, if y'all if y'all enjoyed the video, go ahead and shoot me that thumbs up if you don't mind. And um, yeah, like I said, you know, just appreciate everything y'all do. Appreciate you watching all my videos, and uh, I will catch y'all later.